And we've got those breaking new details tonight about that alleged illegal cemetery in Pritchard. Mobile County Sheriff's investigators tell us exhumations could start as soon as tomorrow. Let's get right to our Toy Thornton. He's in the newsroom with more on these breaking developments. And Toy, you spoke to some people who live in that area. Yeah, I did, Byron. I think the consensus is they just want this all to end, so they're okay with exhumations happening tomorrow. Interestingly enough, those people I spoke to in the area say the cemetery never really bothered them. I have not smelled any smell. I don't get involved with nothing like that, you know what I'm saying? Neighbors are speaking out about the recent developments with Heritage Memorial Garden Cemetery and Pritchard. Sheriff's deputies were called out last week for reports of a foul odor they believe was coming from a grave. Listen to me, son. Listen to me. Ain't no smell coming out this ground. Now the sheriff's office says it has enough evidence to begin digging into graves. And that's set to begin tomorrow. We're going to have to start you know, opening some of these grave sites and, and to see what's in there and to either substantiate or disprove the allegations. Some of the allegations include bodies being dug up and caskets being reused and bodies not being where they should be. Just concern for the families, but um, I don't feel any danger of it. These folks buried them folks proper. Now, whether or not they acquired the land proper, that's something different. But ain't nobody been out here digging these days graves up. Cedric McMillan is the man in the center of the controversy. He's said to be the owner of Heritage Memorial Garden Cemetery. He's been in court fighting charges for a sex offender violation. Today, McMillan's probation was partially revoked for that charge, and he won't serve jail time. The sheriff's office says they could start digging as soon as tomorrow. It's going to be on a case-by-case -case basis. They'll need consent from the family and a court order. It, it takes a lot. I mean, it, it, a lot of trouble going by in there, getting them out, and they're putting them in there. Check them, mm -hmm. but put them people back at peace in their ground. Mm -hmm. Let them lay in peace. And again, the sheriff's office will start digging tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. And they agree. Captain Birch says either way this turns out, he's hoping this is the last leg of this investigation. Live in the newsroom, Toy Thornton, Fox 10 News.